Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us continue with the next question. That is a gate CSE 2016 set to 1 question number 20. Okay. So this is also a question based on queues and queues only. Okay. Yes. So let us start. A queue is implemented using an array such that NQ and DQ operators are performed efficiently. Okay, so Q is implemented using a array. Okay, so it is an array. So we are having two different pointers. For sure, you should have two different pointers, right? So insertion will be taking at the end and deletion will be taking at this end. Okay, which one of the following is the correct operation? So N refers to the number of items in the queue. Okay, so what are the options? So the first option states that both operations can be performed in big O of one time. Okay, so basically the Q operations, uh, insertion or deletion, both of them will be at big O of 1, okay. So, let us cross check it, don't worry. So, let us keep that option for now, okay. So, at most, one operator can be performed at big O of 1 time, but the worst case time for the other operator will be big O of N. So, why will it go to up to big O of N, guys? You can directly delete the element, right? So, what's there in that? Okay, so he's not even asking about circular queue also. It is normal queue only, right? Yes, so you can get both of them in one. So obviously this option is wrong. Similarly, the worst case time complexity for both. Okay, so it's wrong. It's wrong. So basically, simply you can say both the operations can be performed at a big go of one, guys. Because you can insert the element, you can add the element at the end and you can delete the element from one end, right? It's simple. Okay, so both of them can be done at a big often. Okay, yes, so I hope everyone got some basic idea on this. So, in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.